If you need Madden 21 coins for anything, make sure to go to buymuttcoins.com. Check it out with the link in the description and my code MMG is 15% off. <laughs> Luna, were you eight inches deep in my- Whoa, whoa, hey, 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 hey. The return. Today, I'm going to teach you how to draw an elephant. Start with a big ear. You know, elephants got big ears. And then you make another big ear and then you do the trunk. And I mean, that's pretty much it. Like, there's not much else to it. This has been drawing with Papa Me. Damn, bro, you got the whole squad laughing. Coochie man. From now on, I'll be naming this board the Board of Absolute Facts. Basically, like the Bible. I'm gonna write something on this, and it's going to come true. I'm gonna write Bella, come back. Lions 12 and 4. Do me a favor, shut, shut the fuck up. up. You already, bro, look at this line schedule. Tell me we're not winning. Well, so we're one and two right now. Tell me that we're not winning 11 of these games. You, if you don't think we're winning 11 of these games, you don't watch football. End of story. The Lions this year are basically like the Lakers. Like everyone is hating on us just because we're the most talented team. Like why don't you just be happy for us so we got a talented squad and we're going to take it all the way. <laughs> Now, you guys may think after last week of my episode that I would be upset, but to be honest with you, I'm feeling pretty good. That guy was good. He knew some meta shit. His team wasn't a god squad, but he was good. And we almost came back down 22-0, but I didn't pull it off, so it's never cool to almost come back. Yo, but can we also talk about how not only did the Falcons choke the Super Bowl by getting fucking rain up on, that they did this shit twice now. They're murdering the Cowboys and they're murdering the Bears and they just got... Cocked. Serious question. Would you rather be a Jets fan or a Falcons fan right now? If you had to like jump ship. My team is looking just like interesting. We have a very competitive team for the playoffs. So I'm feeling pretty good. All right. We got two wheel spins to upgrade this squadron. And then we'll see what we got for the rest of today. Three plays in KO. Team wheel. Dude, the team wheel has just been dominating Wheel of Mud. So any 84, 85 player, if I get Jets, Lions, Bengals, Giants, I'm gonna be really sad. None of those. Ravens, 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 Ravens. This isn't even a team anymore. That's not even a team anymore. Washington football team, I get it. Actually, no, I take that shit back. I don't get it at all. Do you wanna be so unbiased and non-offensive that you're the Washington football team? You're a fucking laughing stock. Why wouldn't they just pick an animal? There's so many animals that aren't a team. Dude, they could be the Washington chinchillas and it'd be better than the Washington football. I'm gonna Google that shit. One eternity later. Oh shit. The Washington football team is a fill-in replacer name. These are the five favorites based on Vegas odds, meaning you could literally bet on this, like bet real money on this. The Red Wolves, the Red Clouds, the Warriors, the Hogs, and the Monuments. I don't know out of those which I like the best. I think Hogs sucks. I think Warriors sucks. I think Monuments is one of the stupidest things I've ever fucking heard. Red Wolves, Washington Red Wolves, I think that's pretty sick. This is gonna be dog shit options, isn't it? I can get a punter, a center, or a left outside linebacker. Yo, if this dude's faster than 74 speed, though, I want him. 80. Dude, this guy's a freak. Cole Holcomb. Absolutely. All right, I'm promoting him to starter. Jordan Jenkins is on the bench. I don't think Jordan Jenkins will ever come back in the lineup. I'm sorry if any of you are like huge Jets fan. <laughs> oh, I said if you're a Jets fan. <laughs> You're, st <laughs> You're starting at back is Grant Gore. <laughs> second, second Will Smith's coming in right now to get our second player. Uh, Cole Holcomb, 85 speed is a good upgrade, but let's see what I can get here. Team captain, no answer. Ooh, ooh, let's go. So I can't choose from every single 88, 89 players to put the poll up on Instagram, but what I can do is sort by time remaining, and then I can choose out of those first 10. So these 10 players right here is who I can choose from. And then I'm gonna make a poll on Instagram and you guys are gonna vote. A few minutes later. Okay, uh, hmm. This is tough because Instagram polls are not as easy as I thought they'd be. I'm an idiot. Out of all of this, I would mostly want Dion or Zeke. So I'm gonna say press yes for Zeke, no for Dion. Sorry, I'm so scuffed. I don't know a better way to do that. So I don't think they have an actual voting feature like Twitter does. I'll leave that boy up for five minutes and we'll check it out. It looks like it's a resounding W for Dion. Dion is currently doubling Zeke in votes with 1,200 and Zeke has 600. So I think we're going 89 Dion. Hey, I respect it boys. I think Dion's a better pickup here for sure. His defense is super good. I have no excuses for taking it out. We should go win.
And again, I'm gonna say this, I really badly wanna complete my challenge wheel challenge. I'm spinning the challenge wheel right now. We'll see what we can get. And I need to take myself to the playoffs and not chug three straight games. Use your corner one dry. No. You guys do not realize how blind I am. If you know glasses prescriptions, I am negative 4.75 and negative 4.25. Okay, Jamal Adams, Lamar. Okay, that's my top three. I see a Tredavious White probably, and I couldn't tell you who the other two were. I do not exaggerate on this. I am so blind. I'm gonna start the game by completing this drive without my glasses. Oh God. Okay, like, all I can see is shapes and figures. I don't know who's who, though. I don't know a single player that he's going to have on his team. There's no way I can read that writing. <laughs> I can't believe I've never gotten this challenge before. I'm going to complete it right now, so even if I lose, I can open up one of those packs. So for this whole drive right here, I'm going no glasses. And I'm not going to, like, lean super close or squint. Like, I'm going to play this puppy out the way God intended. That is a stop on read option. Honestly, the biggest issue is I can't see how much time is left on the clock or like the down markers or anything. Well, I know he's seconded longer than 10. Oh, I want an interception like this. Oh shit, good dot. Mike Vick to Julio Jones. That's a Falcon squadron right there. I'm not gonna say it's a theme team though. He's gonna get cooked. He's not doing shit in the run game, but his pass game is scary. He's gonna roll left. So we're gonna QB spy there. Oh, what's the assignment on Adams? Play action? Oh God. Oh God, I'm supposed to be deep, aren't I? Throw it here, throw it here. Oh, he got that off? How did you get that off? How weird do I look without glasses? I look weird. Is my camera focused? Oh, fuck. I can't even tell if it's... Fuck. Oh, my QB spy's on the wrong side. That's an L. Ah! Ah, get there! Yes! Is that fourth down? That's fourth down, right? Does that say fourth? Yeah, it says fourth and 12, doesn't it? Dude, I can't tell if it's fucking focused or not. Shit! Who's on the QB spy? Who's QB spying? Someone's a QB spy, right? Ah, I can't tell who's QB spy. Just clamp, boys. One big clamp. Ah! Ah! Yes! Oh my god! How did he defend that? What did he do? That's my drive. Was that Dion? Dude, I think Dion just might have made a nasty play. Dude just made it like the play of the game already. I think I know why I lost last game. I did not utilize Austin Fort enough. I don't think there could be a better explanation. Ooh, do we take off? Ah! <sighs> this game is important. We got Dion Sanders on the line. So, ooh, ooh! That is what I call a spaghetti play, where the code just kind of spaghettis, and you run past someone who definitely should attack him. First and 10, big, big blitz. His controller is off, I think. <laughs> Larry Fitz! I gotta say, I'm the master of showboating at the very last second. I rarely, rarely fuck. I'm playing children. I'm playing people with the mental capacity of little tiny babies. Now this is an issue. This is truly an issue because I'm not sure what to do because this is playoffs now and I can't just go into another game because now I'm in the playoffs. It's a lot more important than that. Let's get my rewards out of the way first and then I'll tell you guys what we're gonna do next. First things first, I get a store pack and I'm definitely gonna do this week 50 fantasy pack, which I don't know what it is. It contains a trace of one of two 81 plus overall elite players. Who gives a shit? I'm just gonna open all right, so all of this, obviously, first round's not gonna help. Second round, you can you can get lucky here. Jerry Judy, no, he does have wheels up. Pick these two. I want to see the new pack animation. You better have a new pack animation for me. No. <laughs> Dude, I swear to God, I literally get the best pulls in Wheel of Mutt. Like, I'll do a whole pack opening video. I won't pull shit. I'll go to Wheel of Mutt for one pack, and I'll get some shit like this. So Todd Gurley or... Yo, nastiest animation. That is so sick. That player is dog shit. I don't want you, Jimmy Graham. I'm obviously taking Todd Gurley. That animation is nasty. All right, boys. One spin on the Rage Quit wheel for a very, very early Rage Quit. I literally got man to Rage Quit with my glasses off. Oh, I got the same one I got last time. I thought we were about to get three store packs, which would have been insane with those packs. But we get the same one as last time. That's still good, because I still have this Joe Thomas for this exact reason. So now our Joe Thomas is 87 overall, which is pretty much what we were going for. So we're sitting at an 82 overall. And now I feel so bad. I can't play another one right now. He's playoffs. But I know this video is going to be short. and There wasn't a lot of gameplay. So here's what I'll do. I'm going to walk you through my message request. And we're going to try and find some funny ones and read them. And then we'll close this video up. I always know that a message is going to be good when it says potentially offensive content hidden so the end of july he says gigantuan pp and then hey <laughs> deck meteor says you're 510 190 and i'm 65245 you know i'm actually honored that you think i'm 190 pounds because i'm not even close to 190 pounds balls in my mouth suck my ass papa pussy ass 
Jesus, that was bold. Do you want to play COD? Do you want to play? Do you want to play? You're my YouTuber. Please, you're my favorite YouTuber. Are you on? Do you want to play, bitch? <laughs> Anti-vaxxer said, harder daddy, eat me up. <laughs> Dog, you guys need to fucking chill. Hey, if you guys actually enjoyed reading those comments, please let me know. I might make that a thing at the end of every Wheel of Mutt. I don't know, it might be funny. I'm sorry, boys. Early rage glitch that happens, Wheel of Mutt. I love you, boys. I'll see you in the playoffs. Peace out.